Hello YouTubers, so this is a little bit of a different video. Again, and this is not a how-to video, this is just a troubleshooting video in case any of you have a Dell D630 or similar laptop acting, kind of having the same symptoms of having, having a screwed up screen from the graphics. It's not a busted screen. So the screen kind of looks all glitched and it's all dots and then you get a bunch of these checkers. Looks kind of interesting, almost like an old NES game kind of a thing. But see, it's asking me if I want to do diagnostics. But, but this is a, this is for sure a bad graphics. Bad graphics on the motherboard, which I ordered a new one. And I know this is not the right way of packing a motherboard. I did not do this. This was the seller, so I hope this motherboard isn't all screwed up. But there is Windows XP on here. And the other problem, the other symptom is when I try to go into Windows XP, I get the blue screen of death. Saying there's like a driver reloop infinite times just pretty much another telltale sign that the graphics is bad i got this from my neighbors about maybe like a week ago because they're like oh we don't want it no more they try tried all kinds of stuff putting new ram and everything in here and i guess it didn't seem to work and i was told that the motherboard is bad so i'm going to attempt to see if i can fix the motherboard i'm not going to cover that in this video this is just for possible troubleshooting this is just a possible troubleshoot option and by the way I paid like 12 bucks for that so you can get these motherboards pretty cheap for at least this laptop every laptop will vary so and I will show you the final results after replacing the motherboard okay so I am back here with the Dell D630 with the new motherboard in and this is the old one right here. And guess what, you guys? This was the issue. It's not fully put back together yet, but look at that. Dell logo. All in one. There was no two Dell logos, and it doesn't look all glitch. It actually looks normal once again. Now, there is no hard drive in here, obviously. Actually, the hard drive and some of the hardware is still out, but. And I just got a little text on the screen saying date and time not set because obviously because I took the CMOS battery out and I plugged it back in. But other than that, this is a working laptop again, but I will come back to you guys with this fully fully put back together. And obviously no internal hard drive, blah 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 blah, yeah, because I don't have a hard drive in there. Very good sign. And this again is a very, it's in very good condition, like, it's not like heavily worn all over the place. There's a little bit of wear on the mouse, the little trackpad here, but other than that, it's in fantastic condition. Okay, so this is the final product, and as you can see, we have a desktop, an active mouse cursor, no blue screen of deaths on this. Booted just fine after putting it back together. So indeed, it was this that was the problem. This year was faulty. So, save another one from the landfill. Now, as my channel's name is Mr. Mercury Fix It. Well, I fixed this and saved it from the landfill. Because my neighbors are just going to throw it away anyways. It also came in this box too. With, got some discs. Almost like brand new to be honest, and then it actually came with this external floppy drive. Which I love these things because I don't know if some of you know, but there's actually a USB port on here, so you could actually you don't have to just use it on this on these specific type of computers, but you could also use it on a on a desktop like this, which I've used and it works perfectly for those of you that like retro retro computers. And you don't have an external floppy drive if you have these laying around well you could use these they work beautifully to write files on a floppy disk so i hope you guys enjoyed this video 
on the on the symptoms that maybe your computer may be having with this screen as, a, as shown in the beginning. I hope this helped you guys and stay tuned for more.